design. So I think this is a great time to do a mid-project evaluation to kind of see where we're sitting on the second story addition that we put on top of our house. Um, we started 14 months ago, roughly, and that first initial phase of the actual shell being built went super fast, right? Within two weeks, it was, it was up. We had walls, we had uh, siding, we had roof, we had windows, we had the skylights were in, everything was, it looked great from outside, but the inside needed everything, right? And I chose to do it all myself. Uh, I got a construction background, so I kind of know how to do the most of it, and the rest of it I just kind of learn as I'm going. But uh, that takes time, and not to mention I have a full-time job, and I've got a family, and I've got a lot of other things that I need to do. So the time for me to come up here and solely do a lot of this work is not always available. So I chose to do that because I am saving money. I saved probably about half of what a GC would have charged to do the whole thing. Um, I was very optimistic initially with, the, uh, with my guess of what it was gonna cost. I took out a line of credit for $50,000 thinking that would do it. Um, it didn't. Uh, the 50 is gone and as you can see we've got the kids room, the actual bedroom looks real good. It's ready to go. Uh, but if you step outside of the bedroom, you go into the rest of the space which has not a lick of drywall uh, hung. It just needs a lot more work. Everything's roughed in, ready for drywall and floor, but we're not, we, we haven't started it yet. I'm about to. <laughs> it's on the list. But not to even mention the third phase, which is what I'm calling the bathroom. The bathroom is going to be some work. Fully tiled, walking shower, whole shot, right? Full bathroom. That's not going to happen for a while. I'm going to finish this all off first, and then I'm going to get to the bathroom. But I estimate that the time frame is going to be about a year and a half for the whole thing. If I can actually get this done within the next three, four months, which is possible. Um, but that's probably double what a general contractor would have done. They would have been in here, they would have been had a crew, you know, just knocking this out and, and getting it done and turning it over to the owner, which would be me. But that would have been, I'm guessing, about $150,000 as opposed to my $75,000 total all-in number. So, in the long run, working out really good for budgetary for us, but schedule-wise, not as great. Um, which also works for us too because we've got three kids we already have a three bedroom house so we really didn't need this fourth bedroom or this full bathroom but man it's really going to be a blessing now that my son is 12 for to move him up here and get the other kids in their own bedrooms um, it's, it's really going to work out great for us and it's going to be it's going to be done when i can get it done and we're looking forward to it